Okay, so, um, to my latest segue project. There's the segue. <laughs> What's left of it? Now it's going to be dual powering. Nice little stand up trike, which does have seat fitting. So you understand what this is actually come off. It goes. Okay, now I bought 340 and ended up having a few issues. Um, long story short, this one's full up in, fully up and running with bigger, better batteries. Double the amount of time. Right on. With this one, the Segway battery happens to be the same power as each motor can handle. So I need to uh, literally either boost this, which I'm not sure is quite possible, or buy two separate controllers. If I two separate controllers for these, it's going to be faster as fuck because I'm going to be going about 400. 500 watt maybe. Either way, I'm going for 36 volts on the blasters and yeah, simple as minimal of 30 volts each. Now, like, seriously power up this be that beast. But yeah, um, it'll have disc brakes on the front, but back brake not needed as it's like fully motor powered. Now this is like um, a a bit of a project. I've got a few projects going on. As you can see, I'm winding up quite a lot of batteries there. Um, all 12 volts, all motorcycle, all just for this, really. <laughs> uh, the total there is 72 volts. I won't be using that. I'll be half them until I get a controller at 72 volt. So, yeah. One of my mates has just bought a 7-800 pound scoot. Congrats. Um, I seriously wish he did a right. Ask me first, because for about a quarter of that, I could have built him well faster than one. <laughs> I'd have like, literally ordered the parts and built it. That's my only problem with building stuff. Lack of supplies and tools. Otherwise, this would have been done months ago. 